combs and things. In today's video, we are touring a single wide. It's the Vin Diesel, three bedroom, two bath, beautiful little cozy home. I absolutely love it. Let's get into the video. All right, y'all, again, this is the Van Diesel or Vin Diesel. It is a three bedroom, two bath, single wide home out here at Wayne Fryer Homes in Albany, Georgia. Cute little home. I think it has a lot of potential and we're gonna go on in so you can see for yourself just how beautiful it is. You enter the home and you can either go to the right down the hallway or you can go to the left into the living room and common area. Nice space in here for furniture. As you can see, they have a couch, uh, tables, uh, sofa table in here. So just think about how you would decorate. You absolutely have enough space in here to do what you uh, choose to do in here and in the right location it would have a lot of natural light. So really pretty, nice size living room, a uh, real comfortable space, beautiful single wide, just absolutely love it. As always, I like to walk around and give you the opportunity to kind of look at how you can space things or how the area really looks. So I'll give you a chance to take a look at that and then we'll go into the kitchen. All right, you have space over here to put a dining room table. I would probably put a small four seater or a small two seater right there by the window. It's absolutely enough space for it. Uh, you have all the space you need storage space you need in this kitchen love the cabinet color love you have a double sink set a nice big window there and lots of counter space because they brought this peninsula around that you can actually add two bar stools to so really nice love it you even have space above the cabinets for decor or flowers or whatever you choose in that area just a really pretty kitchen Through the living room, you have your additional bedroom. So we'll go take a look at them. Again, you pass the front door and this is your hallway. And your you have two additional bedrooms and a bathroom on this end of the house. To the left, you have your first additional bedroom. The specs will be on the screen if I have them. This could either be a bedroom or an office. If it were a bedroom, I would more than likely put um, the bed over in this corner or if it was an office i put the desk there as well but this could be either a bedroom or office it's really depending on what you need you can even put twin bunk beds in that corner so really nice The thing about any home, whether it's a mobile home, a stick built home, an apartment, you can do whatever you like, whatever suits your desire for how the room should look. It doesn't have to be anything that I've named. It could be a craft room or multi-purpose multi room or a storage room or just whatever you want it to be. Just giving suggestions here, you're always welcome to put what your suggestions for the rooms are down in the comment section. Now, I didn't have my light today, so I'm working off my camera light. I hope that this is enough light for you to see. 
um, the space here. Nice size bathroom, just what you need. It has a tub shower combo in here and lots of room in this bathroom. So this is your additional bathroom. And then next to the additional bathroom, bathroom is your second additional bedroom. So this is a bigger bedroom from the first one. Lots of space in here to be comfortable. You could put two twin beds, two bunk beds, a queen. You could even put a king in this size room. So really lovely. I put a desk over there behind the door if it was um, maybe a child's room or you know whoever's bedroom. You could put a desk or a dresser. You have lots of outlets in here. A standard closet everything you need in this bedroom. All right, we'll take one more spin around and then we'll take head over to the other side of the house to take a look at the primary bedroom. Again, this is a three bedroom, two bath. Um, and it is a single wide, really lovely home. Lots of space in this home, you guys. These additional bedrooms and bathroom have really good space in them um and you have a nice common area in this living room slash kitchen you can put two bar stools at that peninsula and you have space for a small table in this area so really lovely really really lovely give you one more look at the kitchen and then we'll move on and i haven't shown you the laundry room yet it's on the other side of the kitchen so we'll take a look at that in just a moment. All right, so you have your back door here, right off the kitchen. And then across from the back door, you have your laundry room. So I like it because it's kind of hidden. You have this little short hallway and then around this corner, your washer and dryer would go. So you have space for your washer and dryer, maybe a hamper in here with your washer on the left and the dryer on the right. So really nice, your laundry room being kind of tucked away and hidden away is always a plus. Uh, and then next to the laundry room is your primary. Now the primary has a really nice size. You can actually put a king size bed in here, which is always a plus. You have a large window bringing in natural light in this room really really lovely love it love it love it so look around the uh, bedroom for a second we'll take a look at the closet and bathroom I do see here that your headboard will probably go there because you have plugs on either side. Um, so that's a nice position for it and you still have space for a king size. Now this is your closet. It's a walk-in closet. Very limited on shelving the way it is. I would request shelving, additional shelving be brought around that left side or either the right or both just so that you have space for all of your things. And of course it would give you, you know, hanging space as well as storage space up above. Now next to your primary closet, you have your primary bathroom, adequate space in here. Again, this is a single wide, this is a cozy bathroom, but it's just enough. And it has a window that opens, which is always a plus. So this is your primary bathroom, tub and shower combo. If it was just me, this would be more than enough for me. I could create storage space in this room or in my bedroom. So really lovely. All right, so how do you guys like these single wides? I know that a lot of people looking for double wides or triple wides or a larger home, but there are people that are looking for a single wide, just enough space for them or to downsize. So if that's you, I have quite a few single wides coming. So tell me what you like about these homes. 
All right, so again, this single wide is called the Vin Diesel. It's a three bedroom, two bath, and it's out here at Wayne Fire Homes in Albany, Georgia. Now, they don't post prices, so if you're interested, give them a call. And if you tell them that Christy from Homes and Things sent you, when you purchase, you get a free furniture package. See you in the next video.